Hello, everybody. Welcome into Talking Pittsburgh on this Tuesday. Very wet May 3rd, 2022. Jeremy Crosby here. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Hope you grab the umbrellas. It's been a wet one out there and cloudy and every other uh, thing you want to say about the weather. It's been there. Uh, but uh, warm weather is on the way. And I saw it today and I was uh, out at a uh, business before nine this morning the chamber and I leaned over to uh, my buddy Scott who's sitting next to me and I said hey there's a warm-up on the way he said no way <laughs> yeah it's happening and uh it's gonna get a little bit warmer after Mother's Day so we gotta make it to Mother's Day then we're gonna start to see a warm-up I saw seven zero on the board that's all I'm saying seven zero anything above seven zero we'll take it right folks at this point you betcha. So, yeah, get excited uh, for that uh, as uh, the weather uh, hopefully will get better here real soon. We've got a busy show coming up for you today. We're going to check in and uh, recap some of uh, Town of Madison. Uh, there were a lot of questions about the transportation. Madison Metro is working on a network or redesign for the transportation. We'll talk with Chad Brecklin uh, coming up. Plus, we'll check in with uh, CC at the Fitchburg Recreation Department, uh, get an update on what's happening here as summer gets a full force. She's line up for you we are going to be go 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 to get you the information on what's happening at the rec department but first let's get you the headlines and uh, as warm weather starts to come alive so does the fitchburg farmers market that's right first far outdoor farmers market is back it's this thursday this thursday it's gonna be some live music and free tote bags as well 3 to 6 p.m 3 to 6 p.m every thursday after that moving forward fitchburg farmers market is back there's also some new vendors joining in this year as well so get yourself down to the farmers market it's going to be a good time and just excited that if that doesn't say summer i don't know what does as uh, far as farmers market go farmers market vouchers uh senior center reminding you starting in june the area agency on aging aaa the County will be distributing farmers market vouchers to older adults for using and purchasing fruit, vegetables, and herbs at farmer markets, uh, farmers markets, uh, and roadside farm stands in Wisconsin during the 2022 growing season. That's June through October 31st. The vouchers are distributed on a first come, first serve basis to those aged. Plus, who live in Dane County and have a gross income under $25,142 per year or $2,095 per month for one person household and $33,874 per year or $2,823 per month for two person household. One set of vouchers per household, regardless of the household size, they'll be distributed uh, by the mail. Individuals who received vouchers last year will automatically receive them. Them, uh, and an application may by mail this year. If you wish to apply for the program and or update your address, contact AAA dietitian Shannon. She'll get you hooked up. Application or, or applications will be mailed out during the week of May 15th. Once you received and approved, your application voucher will be mailed starting on June 1st. Public library will be closed tomorrow. Uh, the Public Library will be closed for a special in-service day on Wednesday, May 4th. So if you got any library materials or library plans for Wednesday, going to have to either get there today or wait till Thursday as they have an in-service tomorrow. But when they return, uh, they'll have uh, some fun events coming back. Preschool art, butterflies. Get excited. I know Scott is. Friday, May 20th. He's because he's in the office here. He's so excited. Let's celebrate spring as we use simple techniques with dot markers to create some beautiful butterfly art. It's happening May 20th at 11 a.m. at the Fitchburg Public Library. All right, join the Fitchburg Senior Center celebrating Older Americans Month. This is such a cool event. And uh, reason we bring it up, well, we got to make sure if you're interested, you're over 90 and want to participate, that you get signed up because RSVP for this, you have to be by tomorrow. So let's tell you about it. All right. Uh, the uh, Senior Center is holding the Celebrating Older Americans Month event. If you are 90 years or older or better, this party is especially for you. One of a kind. Wednesday, May 18th at the Fitchburg Senior Center. Uh, includes a photo of all the 90-year-old plus uh, arrived by 8, 1130 of the day of the event. At noon, Mayor will make some comments. There'll be lunch. And following lunch at 1230 p.m., the Fitchburg Seniors take the stage. 
package for a special performance. But you need to RSVP for lunch and for the program by Wednesday, May 4th. That's tomorrow. So please, if you want to be a part of this, register right now. 608-270-4290. Give them a call and get your reservation in. Turning our attention, there's been a lot of talk about this. We've talked a little bit about here on the show, Andrew and I have. No Mo May is here. It sounds really cool when you say it out loud, by the way. No Mo May. As the sun starts to come up and the grass starts to grow, please keep in mind, no Mo May. This initiative is proven to help provide pollinators a substantial source of food and help their uh, po- uh, populations thrive. That's a lot of population talk and pollination talk right there. In 2020, a sample of the Nomo May lawns in Appleton found bee populations increased five times and tripled the bee diversity compared to uh, nearby mowed lawns. Check your local, local government as many areas are suspending lawn mowing ordinances during the month of May. Well, the city of Madison has not waived that, and I don't believe the city of Fitchburg has either. Keep that in mind. Uh, You know, still, you could partake in this if you want to uh, and not uh, mow, uh, but check the limits. Got to remain under a certain, and I'll want to check into this and see what uh, ours is here in Fitchburg because it's a great, uh, great event uh, to part in and help uh, those bees thrive.